So let me tell you why I'm at this bar. Billy wrote me a letter, and I want to read it to you. Dear Mr. Taffer, I've been to two of your seminars in Chicago a few years ago. You said if I ever needed anything, you'd remember me and help. I'm willing to step back in and do whatever it takes not to lose my business. Please, Mr. Taffer, help me. I will do anything. Hmm. Kev, what's Billy doing right now? Playing pool and taking shots. He's not doing anything. Mm -hmm. There's Waterman. Where the who's at? Waterman is a friend who worked there for years who chose to step up and be a manager. He doesn't want to. But if he doesn't, this place is going to go down. Let's get up. Let's get high. Let's get drunk. There's Razzo. She's a bartender. Hey, look at her. No. <laughs> She's pulling a beer They're with definitely. a cigarette in her hand. Oh. Look at that right there. Oh, oh, oh over the drink. Grabbing it, yeah. grabbing it on the mouth is always a great, great option, too. And there you go, Kev. You just licked her cigarette filter <laughs> when you take a drink of that glass. No drinks here. <laughs> There's Crystal. She's a bartender and assistant manager. There's Carolyn. She's a server. I don't know what's going on with her. And there's Rob, Kev. He's the kitchen manager. Give me a little while. They just put in a big order. So for recon, I got two Kansas City Chiefs offensive linemen, Mitch and Andrew. They know bars. They know this town. I thought they'd be perfect to give us a scoop on recon. So this is a big moment for Billy and the staff. Let's see if they deliver. What are we having tonight? I'd usually do something like mix, maybe a little sweet or fruity. You can do like a long beach, which is basically a long island, but with cranberry juice. I'll give that a shot. Did you give them a menu? I don't know what to order. I need to look at the menu. So she's made no effort to sell them anything. Ooh, we're getting live over there. So the shot comes first. Let's see, now she's going to clean up the shots. That was a she now has everybody's saliva on her hands. Right from touching the rim of all those glasses. Wipes, Wipes her, her mouth, mouth with her hands, puts her hands through her hair. She's doing it all wrong. She hasn't done one thing right. Long Beach. Oh, look at the color of that. I'm actually confused at what she just put in there. Even if it's sweet and sour and cranberry, that color is not normal. That tastes good. It's not doing much. It's just like kind of watered down. Oh, man. So what's the deal with, uh, with ordering this food again? OK, so you're going to go to the food window. You're going to order from the food window. Now, the fact that she couldn't write it down and bring it over there with the nine customers they have in a room is absurd. So I don't get why you can't just like order there, but whatever. You guys got any question about the menu? Now, would you ever order food from a guy with that towel on his nah, shoulder like that? Not at all. I would ask him, did you clean your neck with that towel? I just want to know. Yeah, I get for you. I'm gonna order just a big burger. Can I just get a uh, grilled chicken? And that's gonna be at least a 30 minute wait. You guys okay with that? 30 minute wait, at least. Razzo's supposed to have a shot with the girls over there. I know. I wonder how many shots she's had tonight. I don't know. What kind of owner would just say whatever? Shrug it off. She can well, get drunk, steal money, fall. You know what I'm saying? I don't understand it. And whose booze know? is she drinking? Billy's! Yeah. Exactly. Here we go. So he's thrown raw chicken on the grill, Kev. Has he washed his hands? Not at all. Look at him going in the bag. Yeah. Now he's going in the bag for? Nice oh, for chips. chips. Oh. So that whole bag would have to be thrown oh, away. Nice. Look at that. So those aren't nachos. Those are more like deathos. Yeah, yeah. Right? You can eat some yeah. raw chicken on your nacho chips. Can yeah. you imagine? No, I'm, I don't want to. Look at that grill. Now, I thought that was a charbroiler. It's so black. That's a flat top. That thing ain't been clean since the early 70s. <laughs> Now, whatever he's cooking has got to come out with some black on it, doesn't it? Yeah, no doubt. Wipes that rag again, touches it all with his bare hands. Oh, man. And now with, with his spatula, he goes to scoop up that chicken. And what goes with the chicken on the bun? Some of that disgusting grill. Her eyes are definitely glazed over. You guys doing all right down here? You guys have, uh, like, tequila? Oh, yeah. You want some D? Yeah. You want, I'll take it. the D. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> you can do mine like slightly less. Stop being a vagina. Yeah, she's getting drunker and drunker. I will f you up, bro. So he writes me this letter, tells me he's failing, he's losing everything. Razo's drinking, he doesn't even care about it. She's getting drunker by the minute, and he's taking shots and playing pool. You know what? 
I want to see if he's ready to do anything. I'm going to go in and talk to him. I'll get him, John. How you doing, sir? Question is, how are you doing? Could be better. So I read your letter. You said you would do anything to save your business. Do you have any idea what's going on up there? No. So how are you going to save anything? I guess I might have to do something. What did you do tonight? Play pool. Did you even look at what's going on at your bar? So what the hell are you doing, Billy? I guess I'm doing it wrong. No, you're not doing it wrong. You're not doing so you're race car guy. When you lose and lose and lose and lose, what do you do? Do you do something different? Yeah, fix it. What did you do here? Nothing. I didn't do anything. But you're losing every day, right? Yes, sir. And now you call me to bail you out. Let's go over to your bar for a minute. So, girls, why don't you light up another cigarette back here? There we go. So, is this legal to smoke behind a bar, Billy, is it? Because things like this happen, and now you can't consume any of those beers, right? Right. You're pulling a beer with the cigarette over the beer. But you didn't see that, Billy, did you? What about you, Waterman? Did you do anything other than drink water tonight? No. Who does she work for? Us. How many more shots are you going to have? You have one more drink, I will fire you. Do you understand that? I am a little intoxicated. I'm a little drunk. I have taken shots after shots. I'm admit that. I feel stupid right now. I should have been sober on my A game, and I wasn't. Hi, this is John Taffer. Click here to subscribe to Paramount Network on YouTube for more Bar Rescue.